smiling faces every time we walked in. It made us feel so much better because there were certain days that it was a lot harder than others. Home away from home. That's what the Ronald McDonald House in Louisville was to Tiffany and Martin Pruden. When their son Jerome was delivered prematurely at 27 weeks, he spent the next several months at Norton Children's Hospital. It was a safe place. It was comfy and cozy. I was able to have a place where I could recover from my surgery as well. The facility on First Street was expanded from 27 to 63,000 square feet, growing from 36 guest rooms to 56, the largest expansion in its 37-year history. Shortly after opening in late February of 2020, the pandemic hit. CEO of the Ronald McDonald House, Hal Headley, says the extra space was a blessing. What we were able to do thanks to our expansion was to better uh, keep families that we were already serving more socially distanced, better able to serve them meals that they count on from us and so many other things. Being from Owensboro, the Prudens appreciated having a place to stay just two blocks from where their baby was and everything they needed was there. You know, you don't think about washer and dryer, you know, toilet paper, paper towels, basic stuff you don't think about that you use every day. Now 10 and a half months old, Jerome is growing every day and on the verge of crawling. The Prudens say they donate to the Ronald McDonald House and drop off supplies when they're in town for doctor's appointments to give back to the place that gave them so much. They helped us in our time of need and all we want is to give back to them and make sure that they are able to help other families. Alex Durham, WLKY News.